What else is there but the past? What else is there to have faith in? It is not in us to believe in the future. We distrust it. We cannot be convinced. We believe only in what our eyes tell us. Seeing is believing, but the future can never be seen, and so it remains unbelievable. We are too short-sighted. Even in our darkest moments, we never believe in our hot hearts that we will ever change. We go blindly on. We have faith only in then and now. At least we have something then. At least then we have faith in history. The Spartans set great store by faith. Their multitudes of dire gods were like the old deities of Gilgamesh, which 3,000 years before had swarmed like flies over the sacrifice. But their way of life too required fidelity. The Spartans believed in Sparta as fervently as they believed in any god. Their state was an America, a dream of perfection. They lived out their lives in the shadows of their beliefs and saw the fruits of doing so through generation after generation. Their city's power was the proof that their faith was well placed. For half a millennium and more, the hollow realm remained safe from the world, stronger than the world, the wallless city inviolate, the red cloaked phalanxes unmatched. And then, inevitably, their time passed. The greatest soldiers in the world were, un were beaten. The enemy trod them underfoot into the mire of their own meat. Lecedaemonia was lost. The meadows of the Erotus burned. The strong women of Sparta ran screaming into the streets. It must have seemed to them as if the Tegetos had been torn down. The gods they loved had failed them. The Spartan dream had been destroyed. And what did they put their faith in then?